so hi everyone today we will be discussing about the free api key for the flux model launched by black forest labs yesterday so basically black forest labs have launched a new set of text to image model that is flux which is available in three versions and as said the results are at par with stable diffusion and mid journey i myself tried it out and the results are looking just amazing so i think it's worth trying out so to get started you first need to create your free hugging face token the read token this is free to create so you just need to go to your hugging face account login go to access tokens and then generate a read token once done you need to pip install gradio client you need to import client then load the model flux.1 hyphen snell and then just call this particular function client dot predict which has the prompt seed width height etc the most important part is the api name that is forward slash infer so in this particular case i am passing out the prompt baby is doing skydiving and drinking cold drink and in the result you can see that it is giving me a url on my local system so let's check it out how the image is created what is the quality of the image so as you can see that the result looks pretty good they are skydiving they are having cold drink they are babies so the results are just awesome in the second prompt i tried with cats and dogs attending corporate meeting the same parameters we will again check the results so even this looks pretty good a cat and dog attending a meeting uh, if you have enough harder resources and you don't want to use the api you can even load the model as well i don't have it but i have got the codes for you so eventually to get started you need to pip install this particular git repository diffusers if you know once done you need to again pass your hugging face token and then call the flux pipeline that is imported from diffuser passing the id for the model black hyphen forest hyphen labs forward slash flux point one hyphen snell once done you need to again call this pipe object passing the prompt so nothing else some other extra parameters that i haven't di deep dived into but as the model size was huge i was not able to load it into collab as well as in my local system you can see my ram and disk is full so you try it out with the local models as well and if you don't have the enough hardware you can go with the free api as well to be honest the results are looking just amazing and i and i would suggest you to you start using flux because it's for free mid journey is not available to everyone and i think looks to be a great model thank you so much